Dexter, a fawn-coloured French bulldog, lives with his human in an apartment in New York City. He eats food cooked especially for him, has four beds and countless tennis balls. Size small, of course. According to his human, Dexter enjoys eating, sleeping and sniffing. But Dexter has another life his human knows nothing about. He is the famous Detective Dexter. Every morning after his human leaves for work, Dexter puts on his detective hat, heads out onto the terrace, leaps onto the ledge and hops onto the fire escape where he keeps an office. His trusty assistant, a Pomeranian named Peanut, is always early and there is always a line of city dogs who need help. Today, there are no dogs lined up. It is pouring with rain. In fact, it's raining so hard, it's coming down sideways. Dexter is lounging on his bed. Suddenly, he hears a commotion outside. Hey, I'm dumpster diving here. Dexter goes to the window. He sees Gary Garbage, a bull mastiff, feeding on leftover pizza in the dumpster. Around the corner, a brown dog Dexter has never seen before watches as the dog catcher gets out of his van and walks towards Gary. Dexter barks, but it's no use. Gary Garbage can't hear his warning. The brown dog looks up at Dexter's window. He smiles an evil smile. The dog catcher grabs Gary Garbage and puts him into the back of his truck. He gets in and starts the engine. But before he leaves, the dog catcher rolls down his window and tosses a stake to the brown dog. Dexter can't believe it. Could this dog be helping the dog catcher catch other dogs? He'll figure it out, but for now, he's got one mission. Save Gary Garbage. Dexter squeezes out the window and onto the fire escape. He runs up and bumps directly into Peanut. <sighs> What's all the commotion? So much barking. The dog catcher just got Gary Garbage. <laughs> Dexter and Peanut make it to the street just in time to see the dog catcher turning the corner. They run after him. Okay, Peanut. When he stops at the light, we jump on the back. They catch up to him one block down. The light turns red and the van stops. Dexter and Peanut jump onto the back. It's a long and bumpy ride, but finally they reach the pound. Dexter and Peanut jump off and hide around the corner. The dog catcher takes Gary Garbage inside. Dexter and Peanut run around the building and jump up onto a trash can. They have a clear view of the inside. Those locks are too high. I can jump, but... Radar? Radar. Dexter and Peanut jump down. They run and pant and run and pant until they reach a building with a big red door. Radar! Radar! The door opens. A huge bloodhound steps outside. Yeah? Help! Gary Garbage got locked up! Lead the way. Radar follows Dexter and Peanut back to the pound. They hide around the corner and watch. No one's there. The usual? Oui, Radar. Follow my lead. Okay! Dexter waits. Peanut runs up to the door and barks and barks and barks. The dog catcher comes outside and Peanut takes off, running as fast as she can. The dog catcher runs after her. Dexter rushes through the open door. Radar follows. Dexter! We are getting you out of here. Hey, Radar. How's it going, dude? Not the time. Radar pulls the lock open with his teeth. Ah, me too! You're next. Gary pushes the door open. You get that door, Radar. I will get the other. Radar and Gary free the other dogs. Meanwhile, outside, Peanut hides from the dog catcher. He searches the bushes, but he can't see her. Dexter, Radar, Gary and the other dogs rush out of the building and make a run for it, just as the dog catcher gives up and turns back. He sees them. Hey, you! Come back here! This way! Gary leads the dogs into an alley. 
As they reach the back of the alley, he squeezes into a small hole in the side of the building. The dogs follow. It's dark and small. Quiet. He's coming. The dog catcher looks around. He doesn't see them. He whistles. The dogs don't make a peep. The dog catcher keeps moving. Come on! Radar leads the way. They head out of the alley and down the avenue. I'll see you later! Radar turns right onto his street and disappears. Hey, all this excitement's got my appetite all worked up again. I'm gonna find a diner and grab some fries. Be careful. Yeah, stay safe. Gary Garbage heads across the street. Dexter watches him. Gary's tail sways back and forth as he trots away, and then hits Dexter. I know that dog. I recognize his tail. He was the one throwing hot dogs down to the puppies. Whoa, 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 who? What tail? (gasps) Back it up to the beginning, please. There was a brown dog, thin and tall, long snout. Looked like a coyote. He led that dog catcher to carry garbage. He watched the entire thing. And once Gary was in the van, the dog catcher tossed him a mighty fine-looking steak. And when we rescued those pups last week, I saw that same tail outside the sewer. It was him tossing the hot dogs down to those puppies. He was trying to lure them so the dog catcher could grab them. Oh, boy. Yes. Gonna have to bring him down then, huh? As per the usual. Let's do it. That's why they call us the D-Team. Yes, well, whatever they call us. Before any more investigating, this team needs some sleep. Yeah. (sighs) A nap or two would be nice. (laughs) Rest up. Tomorrow, we hunt the coyote. Tomorrow it is. Tomorrow it is.